Kunal Chandora and today we are going to understand transient analysis of RC and RL circuit. The panel we are using has order code 36333. So let's move on to the kit. Transient analysis of RC and RL circuit 36333 has been designed specially for transient response analysis with both DC and AC signals as input. It is useful for students to study and analyze the behavior of any circuit during the transient period. Okay. We have one auxiliary supply, one signal generator, one DC supply and two RC circuits and two RL circuits. Description of kit we are using. So let's move on to our objective one. Objective one. Study the transient response of a series RC circuit and understand the time concept, concept with DC power supply. Let's move on to the procedure of experiment 1. Make sure that switch connected across the DC supply is in downward position. Now connect plus 5 volt DC supply to number 1 pin and ground to pin number 2. Now connect DSO across TP1 and TP2 and analyze the waveform. So we have connected DSO across TP1 and TP2. Now we have to turn on the kit and observe the waveform. Now observe the transient response exponentially rising on DSO till the steady state 5V DC supply level is achieved. down the direction so the resistor R will short with capacitor C. Now observe the response exponentially decaying till it reaches reference level of DSO. Now immediately press run stop switch button of DSO to hold the response slow down the DSO screen. As you can see we have done what is written in the manual and it is clear on the CRO. And our experiment number 1 whose objective is to study the transient response of series RC circuit and understand the time constant concept with DC power supply. So let's move on to our experiment number 2 whose objective is to study the transient response of a series RL circuit and understand the time constant concept with DC power supply. Let's move on to the procedure of experiment number 2. Make sure that switch connected across the DC power supply is in downward position. Now connect plus 5 volt output of RL circuit. Connect plus 5 volt terminal of terminal 3 and ground terminal to terminal 4. Now DSO across TP3 and TP4. On the power switch of the trainer. Switch the upward direction so that DC supply will connect to the RL circuit. Now you can see that and observe the transient response. Firstly sudden increase in voltage and then exponentially decaying when we switch off this. So here we end our experiment number 2 whose objective is to study the transient response of a series RL circuit and understand the time constant concept with DC power supply. Now move on to our experiment number 3 whose objective is to study the transient response of a series RLC circuit and understand the time constant concept with square wave TTL. Now proceed to the procedure of this experiment. Connect the signal generator port 1 to terminal 5 and ground to pin number 6. So to observe the waveform we have to plug in DSO in the circuit.
so you can observe the waveform of this circuit we conclude our experiment number 3 whose objective is to study the transient response of a circuit series rc circuit and understand the time constant concept with square wave so let's move on to our experiment number 4 whose objective is to study the transient response of a series rl circuit and understand the time constant concept with square wave so let's move on to the procedure first connect signal generator to pin number 7 and ground to the pin number 8 now connect dso across tp7 and tp8 now switch on the kit so you can clearly see the waveform on dso So here we conclude our experiment number four, whose objective is to study the transient response of a series RL circuit and understand the time constant concept with square wave. So here we conclude our video. If you have any doubt, please contact Tesca Technologies Private Limited. If you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe.